guess the first time I ever shot, I, I didn't know you know, what, what all I was supposed to do and uh, I was still kind of learning. I was a little confused. They had to teach me, teach me things. It's silly, you wouldn't think you'd have to teach somebody how to have sex but having porn sex is completely different than having real sex sometimes. Real sex is probably more just like flowing because you don't have to like make sure like you can like see the pussy or whatever, you know, or like there's no one yelling like open your ass or show me your pussy more. You stop a lot during porn sex. You know, like, it, I mean, it depends what company you're working with, honestly, because I think a lot of companies, you know, like, will stop you to try to get you in the best position so that you can see, like, the dick or the penis and the best shot, you know? So you don't think about that when you're having sex in real life. You're not like, okay, how, like, well can I set up so you can, like, see every part of my body the best? Sometimes you have to have sex with people you don't like, and you still have to get it up and be stoked. And usually in, in real life, you, know, you don't like someone, you don't... You don't fuck them. I'm just being fucking honest. I have sex so often in the industry, like crazy rough or just, I don't know, weird position position sex. So when I go home, I've been dating the same person for many, many years. I'm like, do you want to just like masturbate with my vagina? Real sex is a lot different than porn sex, depending on who you have sex with. If you have sex with a porn guy, it's going to be the same. If I am having porn sex, that is my job. I am coming in with a mindset that this is a person that I'm working with. I'm just there, you know, physically. That's it. It's a physical attraction. And technically, I don't even need that. And and she understands that as well. For me, I always try to fuck on camera um, as I do it in my personal life with the same kind of chemistry and passion and like enjoying it. But it's true that because you are in front of the cameras, you have to take care of the light, you have to take care of the position, and sometimes uh, it's not like the th you don't do the things that you will do in your house. You just you are just doing a performance. That's the that's the the word I want to use. You are performing the sex. What we're doing is to put on a show for the viewer. It's everything that we do is for the people back home that are watching it. Something that looks good to like you guys or you know to somebody that's sitting watching me doesn't necessarily always feel the great for you know the best for me real sex is more like you have more like sexual feelings and you're more into your partner when you're having a scene it's like more uh you must you must show your pussy and the dick and yeah the only difference is that there's always a camera rolling on set not always at home just sometimes the directed scenes are very different than real sex because obviously you don't have someone in your bedroom going, okay, remember the camera, okay, remember the lighting. Well, in porn, we we finally get used to the opening up to the camera angle, but in real life, we don't have to open up like that. I mean, no one has sex in the positions that we shoot in, you know? We're cheating out to a camera. You have to open up for the camera, which means that you have to position your body in a way in which your face and your holes, pussy or asshole, are both in frame at the same time. So like if you're doing missionary sex and you're lying on your back and you close your legs, you can't do that in porn because then they don't see any of the sex happening. You have an audience, which isn't so bad. You know, you kind of get used to it and you get over it and you just, they disappear after a while. But um, you have various people on set for sound and lighting, camera, the PAs, uh, things like that who are always just kind of like staring at their phone bored. Or if the guy is struggling or something is not going right in the scene, they're kind of just like looking at their imaginary watch because no one has a watch anymore. Waiting, they're like, come on, we just need 25 minutes. Can't you guys just fuck for 25 minutes? They can actually see the action, but that, that means the guy's kind of twisted and he's not necessarily, you know, we're not having sex the way that I might want to do it at home. I don't want sex, I want closeness. So instead of like, actually like, oh, I just want to fuck you, I'm like, no, I just want to feel your skin against mine, or I just want to feel a connection, I want to feel closeness. That's why I look for outside of the industry, because in the industry it's really hard to connect with people on another level. But I think you, mm, as an actress, have the, the responsibility of not being only a performer. You also have to enjoy what you're doing and showing it to the camera. So the real chemistry 
can be um, can be shown on the screen.